You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by NewTek, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Hey everybody, welcome back to our continuing coverage of 2014 CES. I am John P. I'm Rene Ritchie, and Kelly got me dancing, John. Now it feels awkward because I'm the only one. Yeah, well, we got you dancing last night too at the meetup. Have you seen the video? I saw, that wasn't so much dancing as, uh, I don't know, what do you call it when someone moves awkwardly for and no reason so and no one enjoys it? We hope you're enjoying all of our CES coverage. <laughs> I don't <laughs> know. Coverage, that's for I sure, shook things that should never have been shaken. Uh, do what? A full body yeah, full. D Dave says it's a full body drive. I never right? liked Dave. If you guys didn't see it, yeah, I didn't like him either. <laughs> if you guys didn't see it yet, uh, we posted a little video of the uh, meetup. Yeah, the meetup. It was fantastic. And by the way, thanks to all of you who came out for the meetup. But thanks to all of you who are also watching all of this continuing coverage. Callie is taking a break. We are up here to relieve her and Phil. We have. And over. we have a very special guest. I've been waiting for four days. For Brandon from Striker Hand Tools. That's right. Dot com. Hopefully we're gonna show I'm gonna show you something a little bit different than what you've been seeing here before. Those look like World War II battle mines. I know, exactly. Don't they? <laughs> They're actually functional. <laughs> iPhone out of the way. So yeah, you won't. guys, um, yeah, what first of all, you the company name is has hand tools in the name. Exactly. What are you doing at CES? We started off as a specialty hand tools company, and this was around 2006, 2007. This is what the, one of the first lights we came out with, and it was designed for electricians and HVAC guys. So when they're going into a place that doesn't have power yet, they can click this to any of the metal, and they can set it all up. Let's show them what it is. Wait, you're saying it has magnets? It, it has 12 rare earth magnets, neodymium magnets, extremely powerful, and each of these posts act like tripods. So if you don't have a magnetic surface like this table, you can aim the light in a bunch of different directions, and of course you can twist it all around. They, they and that gets light where you want it, but a lot of the electricians, obviously there's metal, it's small, they can keep it in their tool pouch, click it up to the circuit breaker box, do all the wiring they need to do, and go from there. But it had such a broad appeal. Uh, we started selling them on ThinkGeek, and the guys were using them in server rooms, all different places, so. Well, That's why we're here. Are, it's impossible to find light in a server room. We used to use our iPhones and try to shine the screen right. onto the components. And you're you know, pulling out wires, you're mixing everything up. Same with home theater. These things are great. You just click them on the back, you see all your wires, get it all plugged up, and then you throw it in your pocket and you take off. Nice. One thing that, that we got on feedback was it needs to be brighter, <laughs> it needs to be more powerful. I think we're going to need a bigger so light. We came out to Good the God. <laughs> the big so this, daddy. So this is a baseball sized version. Same principles that you can use all the posts as tripods, quad pods, whatever. John, what that's we did no in the back, Wait, What's the big red button? The, this button right here yeah. is the switch. Don't touch that. Yeah. <laughs> and we found a lot of motorcycle enthusiasts love the hazard lights because they're traveling cross country. They don't have hazard lights on their bikes and they're parked off on the side of the road. You can click this to the side of your bike, let it flash all night. It lasts 72 hours. Wait, let me Good try go. some. I'm gonna. I want to stick this like right. Let's see, wait, how do I turn on this one right just here? Just keep clicking. Oh, just keep clicking? Yep. Oh, wow, wow. good God, that is bright. That is no so moon, that's a battle station. We can, yep. we can just stick it right there, and it's stuck to the table. I love it, these are awesome. How much are they and where can people get them? Or did you already say that? No, I didn't. The little ones, $6.99 retail, you can find them for a little bit less, sometimes $5, and the big one's always $19.99. 20 bucks and five, six bucks. That is a good deal. Them. I am buying all of them. I yep. know, can we get them on like Amazon and stuff? Or you can get them on Amazon. You can go to our website, strikerhandtools.com, and we have links to all the online distributors and in-store distributors. I know you can't condone it, but I would like to turn these on and just throw them, and they will stick to the metal service. I want to stick them to the ceiling of this hall, but I'm afraid they're going to, you know, if I don't make Follow it all the way up. <laughs> so oh, I'll wait until yeah, yeah. everyone kind of clears out. I'll take a handful of them. About 4.30, yeah. we'll yeah. have this whole area all ready. Stop by the booth. We'll hacky sack revolution. Like yep. That would be awesome. Okay, these are badass. I want like 12 of them, okay? Yeah. So what right. else we got? The next is our Flexit light. Now the idea behind this, it's less than an inch thick. It's great for backpackers, they can throw it in their sack, it doesn't take up much room. And what you can do is it's got three light levels, you bend it up, you can wow. take the lights, and you can focus all 16 LEDs to a single point to have a very bright light, or you can bend it around and turn it into a lantern. And this is great at your campsite, this is also great in your house if you ever have a power outage. 
You just sit this thing on the coffee table, it'll light up your entire room. And how bright are the lights? Uh, this is 128 lumens. You don't want to stare at them, I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> so yeah, you can bend it, you can go down. It's great, again, these are all work lights, so our LEDs are a very wide angle. They're different than a lot of flashlights that go for a long throw. Yeah. We want to light up as much surface area as possible. So again, in the server room, you can click this and you can use it as a dome light. It's an area effect weapon. Exactly, you can bend it around, you can just wrap it, hang it, do whatever you want with it. How and much is that? This is $29.99. And it's got two big magnets right there two on big, that plate. Two big, rare And a hook, and, and a hook. And a hook. Carabiner it to and something. It takes standard AA batteries. <laughs> Oh, you said twenty nine ninety nine, twenty nine ninety nine. Okay. And how long will it last on average on those batteries? On low power, which is just the two LEDs, it's seventy two. On high, it's between ten and fifteen, depending nice. on the quality of batteries. Seventy two hours. I could fix my car, maybe. And that, no, I couldn't. Maybe I could man. never fix my car, but it would help a lot. I couldn't yep. do it. <laughs> so those those are our lights. All right. We do have what we call the mm. simple sucker. The simple sucker. So we have obviously a bunch of different colors. It's a real simple, inexpensive, portable phone mount. So it's a double-ended suction cup with a flexible bit in the middle. So you can bend it in any direction, and you just attach. So if nice. you're at your office at work and you're watching a podcast, you just set this up, you know, plug in your headphone jack, do whatever. You get it elevated off the table. It's also great for Skype, QuickTime. Because rare time. earth magnets and phones shouldn't really, they don't play as well No, together. we didn't use rare earth <laughs> magnets in this product. Here, pull this off. <laughs> I'm gonna pull you off first, Go ahead, John. Pull it off. Wow, that is pretty strong. Such a sucker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These are fan and they come in a wide variety of colors, so you can match either your case or if you have, you know, an iPhone 5C exactly. or a brightly colored Android device, you can match your device. How much did we yeah. say they are? These are $5.99. You can find them for five dollars online. Nice. But wait, there's more. But, but wait. wait. Oh, you know what? I do have another light. Oh, you do? And this light is actually special because we're just launching it for the first time at CES. Nice. So what this is, and this is uh, pre-production. These are prototypes. Okay. So not quite finished So yet. hopefully they all work when we turn so them on. So hopefully they all work. We don't <laughs> have a demo fail. Um, it looks like a little miniature nuclear reactor. Okay. <laughs> or a submarine, one or the other. So we call this part the capsule, and it comes with four different accessories. It comes with a magnetic base. I already like what I see there. That's <laughs> badass with the two bag yeah. big magnets. Yeah, and these are extremely powerful. Each one has an eight pound pull force. Wow. So it's 16 pounds. It also comes with a headlamp strap, and then it comes with a spring steel pocket clip, and then it comes with a flashlight lanyard. Wow. So what you do is you click these in, it locks in securely, there's one full ring, so you never have to worry about the product actually falling out. You stick it there, turn it on, big pull switch, and it articulates. Those things are bright. It. Yes. How many lumens is that? This is going to be about 60 lumens. Wow. And we have a low and a high setting, and also it's a big mechanical switch. So if you're out installing gloves. a satellite dish yeah. and you're wearing big fat gloves, you can easily turn it off and adjust it whenever you need to. Awesome. I want it on my helmet. When do you think you're going to be having these come out? We're saying Q2 at this point, and we're hoping for an MSRP of $24.99. Oh, that'd be perfect. you get all four accessories. With all the accessories? All accessories. Yeah, that'll work. And the I last product it. I have, is the garage parking sensor. This uses a little ultrasonic sensor at the bottom, which detects your bumper coming into the car. And what happens, I don't know if it'll work here. Yep, oh, yep. On. yellow, red. As soon as your car pulls in about seven, eight feet away, you get a green light. As you get closer, it turns to yellow. And then on the back, we have stopping distance of one, two, and three feet. It'll turn a red light. So it prevents anyone in your family from, you know, ending up in the, the living room or yeah. driving through shelves. Putting a little uh, mark in the sheetrock. Exactly. Can I put that on the wall and just stop you from coming close to my stuff? Yeah. Yeah. We, you can mount it to your shelves. You can mount it to your refrigerator. Red light. Whatever step away I'm from the stuff. Wear one on my back. It's like, <laughs> keep away from me. I need my personal space. Do it. You know? That's cool. And when are these available? These are available these now? These are available now. They're twenty nine ninety nine. Twenty nine ninety nine. Amazon. Amazon. Wherever. Our website. Yeah, oh, there's uh, come, this one's actually in Lowe's, so. Uh, and Lowe's, awesome. Yeah. We'll make you a chain, John. You can wear it like Flavor Flav. That would be sweet, actually. <laughs> that would be Telling awesome. Uh, that is good stuff. Now, you guys, the, is this like pretty much the full line, or you guys have a whole bunch of stuff? This is pretty stuff? much the full line. We're a very small company. Uh, these are all my designs. I kind of just try to do innovative things. I have the freedom to kind of come up with different things. I think we're going to start relating the cell phone accessories with the light accessories in the next <laughs> Couple of months. Can't okay. really say much about it. But okay. We got some ideas. But you'll keep us up to date. I will keep you so guys we can share with you guys. Yep. Any, do you guys have any, have any questions? Uh, Mark, 
Mark NL says, does it get, I think he's talking about the parking one, does it give a warning when the yeah. battery runs out? When the batteries <laughs> run out, these the, the four AA batteries will last about a year and a half. Oh, wow. And what'll happen is there'll be a red constant blinking light so you know to change them. And like I said, it mounts with Velcro. You can screw mount it if you want. So that way you can just pop it off the wall, change the batteries, and you're good for another year and a half. Yeah, Rolo says, yeah, I use a tennis ball. Have you guys seen that? The tennis yeah. ball trait, you put, put a hole in the tennis ball, hang it from a ceiling on the string. It looks really tacky. My yep. father did and that when I learned to drive. Hey, it works. <laughs> if you know, if that's what you have, that's what you but have. That but doesn't have LEDs, and it no. doesn't have ultrasonic sensors. And, and this is only 25 cool bucks, people, with. okay? Yep. I mean, the freaking tennis ball and the rope's gonna cost you five or ten bucks, so you might as well get one of these. After the day, you don't have a tennis coffee. ball just hanging randomly hey, yeah, in the garage somewhere. You have to walk through your garage <laughs> in the dark and right. boom, right in the tennis ball. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, Brandon, thanks so much for coming and showing us all your goodies. Yeah, it was great meeting y'all, you guys. Um, I love watching your shows. So thank, thank you so, so much. Great to be here. Appreciate it. All right. Well, you guys stay tuned. We got a lot more coverage here coming out of CES 2014. I'm John P. I'm Renee Ritchie. Be right back.